Hello and welcome to a very curious place. You know, after I posted the last video, and it was on the YouTube part, because I posted the same video about, you know, possible um, shortages over onto YouTube. And I got kind of a snarky comment on it, making a, a comment about how, you know, well, you must be new to this because, you know, long-time preppers have already worried about, you know, and dealt with the issue of, you know, inflation and shortages. But have we? Have, have all, any and all preppers dealt with the issue, really? I mean, think about it. Did anyone really plan for this? I mean, maybe there were, like, the, the doomsday preppers that were like, you know, oh yeah, the end of the world, the end of the world. But I don't think anyone really ever planned for a pandemic where they locked you down and where, you know, uh, it all just basically went straight to hell. <laughs> I, I don't... I don't think anybody really planned for that. Do we really plan for inflation to hit like this? Do we really plan for shortages like this? I mean, you think when you start looking at things and you think that perhaps this could happen, perhaps that could ha happen, but I mean, I, I never would have thought that any of this would have happened. I never would have thought, you know, in my lifetime at least, I never would have thought. Um... This hit kind of out of the blue. And, you know, that was the thing about his comment is it was kind of on the snotty side. And I normally try not to let stuff like that bother me. But my thought on that was how hard would it have been just to keep silent, dude? Seriously, you didn't have to make a rude comment. And that's another thing that I started thinking about. Internet and social media and things like this, while in some ways they've been a blessing, because, you know, we can share information. You know, that last post here on TikTok, y'all were getting in the comments, y'all were sharing ideas, information. It was great. So that was a wonderful thing. But at the same time, it has ruined society in a lot of ways. Because now there are no consequences for our words. There are no consequences for a lot of the actions that people do online. So people have no, they don't put any thought into what they say anymore. They just say it with no care or concern or no thought about it. It, it really has upped bullying. Because I know back in the Gen X days, you bullied somebody, you better be prepared to get your ass kicked. So what do you think? Internet, social media, savior of the world, or the dooms, doom of us all? Much love.